Alright, what's going on? Scouts 311 back, and we are in Diablo 3, and we are heading into the Cave of the Moon Clan, level 1. So let's go down here and see what we can find. Hopefully a decent chest, a boss, maybe get a drop that's worth a damn. The thing about this game is it doesn't really start until you get into <laughs> past the first Die! Um, normal mode, you know, because the only the drops you get are only so good and, and on normal, you know, you gotta keep playing the game to get drops that are, you know, worth, worth a damn. So it almost does kind of want you to speed through a little bit. Well, I don't know about that. It wants you to speed through, but if you speed through and you get to the higher difficulty levels, you start actually getting better stuff. And, you know, so. It's quite an enemy over there. We are in for a fight. for a fight, aren't we? <sighs> Dead villagers everywhere. A hard fight. Time to loot. All right. Warrior of the belt. That's a strength item. Dead end? Dead end. The what only thing that smells here? worse than a goatman is a dead goatman. <laughs> Long I have labored to master the dark arts. Now I finally reap the rewards. For Magda has acknowledged me. She promised me a special task that will bring endless glory to the Great One. I can hardly rest until she reveals it on the morrow. Huh. Magda's got plans. The gods track through me! All right, clan level two. Oh, this might not be the best. I get the belt? I guess I did. What else we got here? Potion. Shield, I think. The bear. Goatman. 
all of my labours were for a bunch of rotten, stinking goatmen. Magda claims that they will become our most valuable allies, and that the task is one that she can entrust to no one but me. But I know my place. I am most bruisingly humbled. Okay. Let's get the good chest. Ah, I need some rares, man. Shield of Lion ain't gonna do us any good. Big dog. Nice. Fine work. That's freaking gross, man. All of everything is flying everywhere. Well, we found the good chest, and that's probably the boss. So we're probably done with this cave, I'm guessing, unless there's a, another boss bigger than that. Except we did find the chest already. Now there's the exit. Any loot? Oh, there's some more things to kill. Oh, treasure. Treasure seeker. What's up, dude? Where are you going? I cannot carry more. Bikes. Ah. Screw that. Those are the oh nice seventeen. You know, in Kingsport, I am known so as thirty five two six. That's not important now. Forty point six. Of course zero. it is. Women become wild and desperate during the end times. Oh, that is awesome. That's a hell of a drop right there. That was worth coming in this cave for us for sure. All right, and now we are able to go through this area here. We got to get to the uh, travel to the Khazra Barricade. Now that we've got the staff. The staff is ours on the side. Khazra, Darkhaz! You thinking that's yours, buddies? I don't think so. It's gonna beat the piss out of you. Got my new knuckles, bitches. What you got? Nothing. They are doing some pretty good damage to me. Give them that. That heal spell going a little bit. It's got a short cooldown, which is awesome. 15 seconds. Hey, shit. Excuse me, I'm sure it'll come into play a lot more as the game gets farther in. You start taking a lot more damage. So basically, going through their little town here, another town, another camp. You gotta time this thing, exploded palm, because it's only three seconds long. But so if you do it right toward the end before you kill something, um, it'll blow up and you know do damage to everything around it. So I've been trying to get it timed. A little, you know, when I'm surrounded by guys. there oh shit man this is a, a trap 
trap. Shit. This is just a freaking badass area. It's fun because you just constantly get sworn by things. And uh, there's a lot of bloodshed <laughs> going through this little, through the uh, camp here. The other thing, the sound effects in this game are pretty freaking amazing. Two, I think, they're just the attacks, the explosions. It sounds awesome. Especially with the monk. The monk is like crazy sound effects because he's just beating the piss out of shit and fucking blowing them up. It's fucking awesome. Okay, how much longer we got here to go through this area? Making quick work of it. I must lessen my burden. I need to sell. Shit, I didn't realize I was... I, I didn't know I was over... I do accidentally grab a lot of this junk that I don't want. The grays and whites, but I'm pretty much full on blues. That's pretty good. A lot of times I click on them on the ground on accident. So we do need to head back to town, do a little Tom Portal, and head back and sell. It's very soon. My buddy, who's the wizard I was talking about, so he's gonna want to jump in and continue onwards. And we only got about five minutes left before it's I quite an enemy over anyway, there. So. We are in for a fight. Nah, these guys are wimps, dude. Okay, maybe not. Where are you going? Nice. Level fourteen. A hard fight. Time to loot. We got a whole bunch of shit in this level. I mean, keep track of everything I said. Alright, so let's finish this map off. Ooh, love, what the hell was that? Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, there's our waypoint, nice. These guardmen the are so daft. 
I think I saw one holding his axe by the wrong end. Man, that's a lot of place to cover before you get to the waypoint. Even though I guess this waypoint kind of covers this area. Let's check out our skills. What do we get? Uh, we got... A f oh, a new rune for our Fist of Thunder, Lightning Flash. Increases your chance to dro dodge by 16% for 2 seconds. Well, we don't have to worry about that right now, I don't think. I mean, we're not having to worry about getting hit that often. We are getting hit more than we've been. I'm keeping Thunderclap. I love it. I love it. And our uh, secondary here. Do we get anything here? No. So we'll keep Crippling Wave there. All right. Breath of Heaven is the heal, so we got something for that. Blinding Flash, we got that earlier, okay. Breath of Heaven also sears enemies for 134% weapon damage is holy, so it heals you and it kills them. That is, uh, pretty freaking awesome. Exploding Palm, we'll keep that one for now, and we got get to choose a new skill slot here. So we can leave this here, or we can add other shit from other skills now. Cyclone Strike. Pull all enemies within 24 yards towards you, followed by a furious blast of energy that deals weapon damage. Okay, well, well, we'll give it a shot. Fleet Footed. So that's 50 Spirit, that's 40 Spirit, that's 25 Spirit. You know what, maybe I'll throw Exalted on for now and put, give me... Should give me 200 and... 50 spirit, which this locks. Yeah, it will. Nice. So that will, uh, it may be starting to use some more spirit stuff now than get more skills. So I might as well give myself a little bit more spirit to work with. Cyclone sounds good, and the fact that I can kill people as I heal myself is really cool. With that other rune. So everybody always, you know, no matter who plays the game, you make a monk, you're going to get the same skills in the same order. But where you really change your character up is in the runes What's that you this, decide then? to use. Or the... My loutish companions passives. have no curiosity about the Khazra. They're only interested in the bounty on their heads. But I am convinced the Khazra can be communicated with. It is dangerous, to be sure, but it is a risk I am willing to take. Would you like a bit of wine? So this is Watchtower. You steal from Oof. drunken sots, do you not? <laughs> How much it's more the stealing? If I give them wine and well, return. Well, you know, when I log, it's not going to matter. Uh, because it's going to all redo itself. I'll be starting at the waypoint up here, and then it's working north. Let's head in the Watchtower. We're going to end the video here. We should checkpoint when we get in. Should we? Or not? Are we not? Really? We won't get a checkpoint? Well, let's see if we can rip through this thing. If I can actually hit these guys. Well, whenever I run into a checkpoint, if I do, I'm gonna chill. Uh, log. I expected more! Even though I do need to sell big time, like I said before. Keep forgetting to do it. I can always head back, but I'll wait until I, uh, hopefully, I don't need to worry about it. I think we're supposed to go through the watchtower, are we? It's watchtower level 2 for the main quest. I don't think so. It would have been marked. This is just a little bonus area. Doesn't seem like it's that big of an area, though. That was a pretty easy first floor.
I'm Ooh, even better. for the scoundrel. Yeah, here's a chest already. Here's our resplendent chest. Wow, this is not a big area, apparently. Let's try this guy out. That brings people toward me. Oh, cool. Okay. Alright, so that brings them all in. And then, okay. So you use Cyclone to bring them toward you, and then you use your Crippling Wave to, to fucking beat the piss out of them, because that hits everybody in a circle around you. Um, that is awesome. The Monk's got some good-ass combos, man. He's all about combos, I think, more so than some other characters. What do we got? Have you ever robbed it? Too? My burden is too is great. Is this really robbery if they don't need it anymore? <laughs> oh, a bow. That's the two-hand monk weapon. I don't know if I want that, though. <laughs> Warden bow of Starlight would be good for the other guy. Man, I really need to fucking go back to town. I just can't take it. I, I can't. I'm not gonna leave shit behind. I'm just gonna sell all this stuff. I've got. I worked my hands to the bone to bring you these it. fine the goods. The bow I'm gonna keep. I know I can't keep some of the stuff for other characters, but I'd rather just sell it right now and get it taken care of, make some money. So I've never tried the bow weapon, the die bow or whatever it's called. I'm not really sure how you pronounce it. So does this help you out? You're at 742. Ah, no. Nah. The other one's still better. So I'm at 4126. Yeah, I have a hard time believing that's going to be better. Let's try it out though, just see what it looks like. I probably won't keep it on, but I've never used it. So no time like the present. My DPS is fucking ridiculous anyway. That's quite an enemy over there. We are in for a fight. That's how we do it in Kingsport. <laughs> I don't know why I like when he says that. Shield of the Hawk, it's a dexterity shield. Not really good for us right now. Well, he looks pretty cool using this thing. Looks a little different. At least. So I got his regular normal attack. Still looks the same, but with his other attack, it seems like he kind of uses it a little bit. Well, that guy's not doing good. Do you miss that girl? Who? The farmer's daughter. Yeah, I miss it. every the whole farmer's place. daughter. We did get the resplendent chest. I miss every farmer's daughter. That's pretty funny. So the chest, you know, there's splint, there's always one in each one. Once you get that, you pretty much got everything. Unless you, there could be an event or there could be something else going down. Okay, you know what? We're going to end here, guys. We're at 25 minutes and we'll continue on to the next video. And uh, we'll have to head up here, it looks like. But um, we're not going to do that in this video regardless. So we'll waypoint back to here and just work our way up in the next one. So it's kind of similar. You, It's always going north. So... Thanks for watching, and we'll see you all in the next video. Take care.